The kids say it's been a game that's been played for years, but a family in Benicia says it's racist and dangerous. The game is called La Migra, a version of hide and seek. Two teenagers got caught in the middle of this game and were chased down and attacked by an airsoft gun. NBC Bay Area Cheryl Hurd was at tonight's town hall meeting where the community is demanding change. 40 minutes were me and my partner Ali terrorized. 16-year-old Z Chavez telling a room full of community members and city leaders about what happened to him on April 8th while going for ice cream with his girlfriend on First Street in Benicia. To hear my pursuers tell each other that uh, me and the person who I love are to be hunted with the purpose of killing. I was frantic. I called 911 immediately. Chavez's mother found out that her son got caught in the middle of a game called La Migra a hide-and-seek activity where older students act like Border Patrol agents and younger students play the role of detainees. You are looking at video we shot in 2018 when police and school officials alerted the community that it was happening and that it was a problem. Now, four years later, Chavez and his girlfriend say they are pawns in this so-called game by being hit with ice bullets from an airsoft gun and called racial slurs. And the fact that my son is Latino and his girlfriend is biracial and then they were thrown racial slurs and they were assaulted with with pellets with BB guns that's not acceptable number one it's not a game I don't even like the characterization the police chief says countless hours are being spent to investigate the incident and prosecuting people involved won't be easy hate crime is very specific Certain things have to occur um, for it to be categorized as a hate crime. You know, the only way that this is going to change is if we have serious consequences to these actions. In Benicia, Cheryl Hurd, NBC Bay Area News.